face on the track on my face to the back Like I'm taking a slap I need a drink but it's straight from the top And I'm hating the slack couple miles from the back Hey, what is going on YouTube? It's your boy HackerTripl07. If you guys are new to my channel and enjoy tech tips, tricks and hacks, please subscribe for more and turn on post notifications so you won't miss when I upload a video. Now in today's video, I'm going to be showing you guys how to increase your dedicated video memory. Now, this is something that allows you a little bit of a performance boost whenever you're playing games. So I'm going to be showing you guys a method which increases my dedicated video memory times four or even more so i'm going to be showing you guys how to do that so first let me check my dedicated video memory so what you need to do is on your desktop you need to right click go into display settings you need to scroll down until you see advanced display settings now you want to click on that and here where you see internal display you need to display adapter properties for display one you click on that and then as you can see here i have dedicated video memory as 128 megabytes so after doing this i will increase my dedicated video memory over 500 megabytes so stay tuned for that so what you need to do is first things first you need to open your registry editor now you can do this by searching for registry in your start menu and it will appear or you could use Windows plus R to open the run command and type reg edit, which is the same thing as registry editor. So once you do either of these steps, you can access the registry editor. So let's click on OK. OK, so the registry editor has been populated. So let me go back. Okay, so it will look like this when you launch it. So you need to follow me in navigating to this specific folder. So you need to look for local machine. You need to expand that. Then you need to expand software and you look for your graphics driver. Mine is Intel or my processor rather. So that's Intel. So once you click on this folder right here, you need to add a new key. Okay, so I'll call this, or you should actually call this GMM and press enter. Now that the key is highlighted over here in the blank space, you'd need to right click and add a new D word or Q word. So now this is dependent on what bit your computer is or bit version. So how you can do to find that is open your file explorer, right click on this PC, go to properties, and as you can see, I'm running a 64-bit operating system. So I'll use the keyword 64-bit. So I'll create a new keyword 64-bit value. Okay, so now this is what you'd need to title this. Dedicated segment size. So you need to title it just as I did here, dedicated segment size, capitalizing the, the first letter of each word. And once you do that, you need to double tap. You need to set the value. Okay, set the value to 512 megabytes and click on OK. So that's basically set. So the next step is to restart your PC. You would not want to you would not want to um, shut down your PC as it would not register a change. So you need to restart your PC. So I'm going to do that and then I'll continue after I've restarted my PC. Okay, so now that the computer has restarted, we will now go and check the dedicated video memory we now have. So to do this, we'll right click, go to display settings. We would scroll down, advanced display settings display adapter properties for display one and as you can see my dedicated video memory is now 576 megabytes so that's more than four times what it was before and this will increase gaming performance so if you guys enjoy videos like this which will show you how to tweak a few settings on your computer please let me know in the comments i will also be doing a video on how to use throttle stop which is basically undervolting your PC, which will increase performance to some extent. So thank you guys for watching. 
Hakuchi Pro 7 Out.